Domo Amejin des. Today we're back with another beginning Japanese lesson, uh, lesson 18 this time, stating existence with Arimas. Really nothing to review. Um, you don't really even need to know past vocabulary all too much with this lesson. It's kind of short. Our key sentence today is Kono mise wa ehon ga arimas. Kono mise wa ehon ga arimas. All right. This is our vocabulary for today. It's a very short list. We start with ga arimas. Ga aru. Uh, there is something. And we'll talk more about this in the grammar section. The word for store in, or just a store in uh, general in Japanese is mise. Mise. Student union. Gakusei kaika. Gakusei kaika. Picture book. This can be really just any book with pictures in it. Ehon. Ehon. Disney World. Disney World. Disney World. Eh, character. 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 This is a character as in like a character from a show or a cartoon or an anime. And then uh, the word for goods or merchandise is goods. Goods. Uh, often you'll see these together as character goods. All right. These are like little toys or figurines of your favorite anime character or something like that. You'll see a lot of those in Akihabara if you ever go to the otaku kingdom in Tokyo. And finally, we have quiz, 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 Japanese. Getting into the grammar, stating existence. Um, all you have to do is say what exists and then ga arimas. Ga is a particle, arimas is the verb, all right? Um, note that only inanimate things can be used with this structure, with this grammar structure. You, you can't say sono hito ga arimas. You can't say that person is here or there using this structure because it's only for inanimate things. That also excludes animals too. A ga arimas. There is a. And you can also conjugate this. A ga arimashita. A ga arimasen. A ga arimasen deshita. Okay, past negative. Examples. Character goods ga arimas. Ah, there are character goods here. Or wherever they're at. Ashita quiz ga arimas. Tomorrow there is a quiz. Ashita quiz arimas. Quiz ga arimas. Okay. Um, and if you add a topic with wa at the beginning and then something ga arimas, you effectively change the meaning of ga arimas to have or possess. Okay. For example, watashi wa kuruma ga arimas. I have a car. Right. 昨日授業がありました. I had a class yesterday. Same had in English. This store doesn't have character goods. Oh, imagine the humanity. What do you have? If you really think about it, the meaning doesn't exactly change. You're still saying that something exists, but it exists for you, right? You're just, it exists maybe in your pocket or at your house or in your bank account, something like that. So the meaning really isn't changing here in English. It, it changes quite a bit, right? There is something and I have something. Those are two different verbs, but in Japanese, they're essentially the same. Activity one, answer each question using the illustrations below. I picked um, four really big popular companies in Japan and actually the first three Eon, 7-Eleven and Book Off are the number one companies, uh, the largest companies in their respective, I guess, fields or area. And Sony, of course, is one of the largest companies in, is in its respective field or area. Um, we have Eon, which is like a supermarket slash... Uh, supermarket slash regular store kind of store. <laughs> it's kind of like Publix, if you know what Publix is, or a Winn-Dixie, or kind of like Walmart, but very smaller Eon. And then we have uh, 7-Eleven. You know 7-Elevens. They, actually, it's a Japanese company, if you didn't know that. Um, it's based, their headquarters is in Japan. They have 
uh, stores all over the world. I did a lot of research for this question. And they're the largest um, convenience store company in Japan. Convenience store. And then Book Off is the largest book buying, rental, uh, selling company in Japan. They also sell other things like CDs and DVDs. And then there's Sony, of course, which is a giant electronics company. So pause the video, try this on your own. I'm going to answer the questions right now. Number one, Eon wa nani ga arimasu ka? What does Eon have? Eon wa, ah, by the way, if you don't know some of these words, normally I put a box up in the corner <laughs> with the vocabulary that would help you solve these questions, but I didn't this time because I want you to try looking them up on your own using some sort of dictionary or whatever. Of course, I'm going to say all of the options here in Japanese, so you can just listen to me, but... Um, we have for Eon, I'll continue, Eon has a banana, a banana, t-shirts, a t-shirt, and a kasa, uh, an umbrella. I'm going to say Eon has umbrellas, okay, implying that they stock them and that they sell them. Eon wa kasa ga arimasu. Kasa ga arimasu, okay? Number two, 7-Eleven wa nani ga arimasu ka? 7-Eleven,は何がありますか? What does 7-Eleven have? 7-Eleven, 7-Eleven,は uh, they have hamburger, they have printer, uh, they also have copy machines, kopiiki, and zashi magazines. I'm gonna say 7-Eleven,は uh, printer ga'arimasu. They have printers, which I used several times when I was in Japan. Number three, book off,は何がありますか? Book off wa nani ga arimasu ka? Book off wa, well, they have home uh, books, they have CD, music CDs, CD, and they have DVD, DVDs, or movies, DVD. Um, I'm just gonna say books. <laughs> That's the most logical one here. Uh, book off wa hon ga arimasu. Hon ga arimasu. Hai. Number four, Sony wa nani ga arimasu ka? Sony wa. Sony wa, uh, well, they have computers, pasokon, they have cameras, camera, and they have TVs, terebi. Uh, I'm just going to say pasokon. Pasokon ga arimasu. Pasokon ga arimasu. And here are the sample answers, which I didn't match completely. Uh, the only different one was number four. Camera ga arimasu. So this name. Number two, um, you should recognize this activity. I pulled it from, I think, lesson five it was, and essentially we're doing the same thing as back then. We're just, we're answering uh, this activity with arimas instead of the possessive no particle. So we have some things here that people own, Kim and Rechalu, and we're going to make two factual statements about each person. We can make three because they have three things. Um, Pause the video, try it on your own. I'm going to solve this right now. Kim wa, let's start with Kim. Kim wa eh, hon ga arimasu. That's one option. You could also say, isu ga arimasu, isu ga arimasu. She has a chair. Kuruma ga arimasu, kuruma ga arimasu. She has a car. Okay? And then Rachel. Rachel wa eh, pasokon ga arimasu. Pasokon, a personal computer. She has a house. <laughs> and finally, she has a pencil. Alright? And the answer slide shows two sample answers. Uh, yours don't have to be exactly like these, but they can be. Next grammar point, stating events. When you want to state where, okay, an event will be held. Um, use this construction. Uh, location de event ga arimasu. All right? And then if you add wa, you can say whoever has the event or whoever's putting on this event. Okay? Um, also note that your classes and lectures are considered events. So if you're saying where your class is, you would use this construction. De ga arimasu. For example, Disney World で、グッズのイベントがあります。Disney World で、at Disney World 
グッズのイベントがあります。There is a goods event or a merchandise, some kind of merchandise event. Probably a Mickey Mouse thing. I don't know. 明日学生あ、学生会館で授業があります。Tomorrow, I have a class at the student union. Or I have a class at the student union tomorrow. Note, these are all events. The first one specifically says イベント。All right. This is, which is why we use で to indicate where they will be with arimas. Activity three, answer each question in Japanese based on Luke's school schedule shown. He's got a few classes plotted here, different times. And of course, at the bottom of the schedule here, I've written in the meaning of basically all of his classes. Because、uh, you're not expected to have those memorized. Only the Japanese class and the English class. Yeah.、Mm-hmm. Number one, let's do it. Pause it right now、uh, if you want to try it on your own. I'm going to solve it right now. Number one, room. 144で、うん、の授業があります。So we're saying at room 144, we have this class, or he has this class. It's implied that Luke is the topic that we're speaking about, right? About Luke, Luke ga wa、えー、room 144 で、and it looks like communication. Communication の授業があります。Okay, at this place. Number two. Somewhere de Nihongo no j u g y o g a r i m a s So let's look for Nihongo right here on Mondays and Wednesdays. Hope you remember your days of the week.、Uh, and the room is the Daigaku Horu. Daigaku Horu.、Uh, and down here you'll note that Horu is hall in English. Number two would be then Daigaku Horu de Nihongo no j u g y o g a r i m a s Loop. Has Japanese class at the university hall in English or Daigaku h o l Japanese. Number three, something mo Daigaku h o l de arimas. So this, we're using mo, and if you remember, mo means also.、Um, in this case, that would mean that he also has this class at Daigaku h o l So, what other class on his schedule is at Daigaku Hall? Well, the pink in the bottom right, Shinnigaku Psychology class,、uh, also says Daigaku Hall. So, we're going to say, Shinnigaku no Jugyo mo Daigaku Hall de Arimas.、Uh, he also has psychology at the university hall. Number four, Smith Hall de at Smith Hall,、uh, Nani Nani no Jugyo ga Arimas. He has this. Class. So, Smith's Hodu, we're going to look for Smith's Hodu.、Uh, and the darker pink, I guess, Sugaku、uh, math class is at Smith's Hodu. So, we're going to say number four Smith's Hodu de、eh, Sugaku no Jugyo ga arimas. He has math class at Smith Hall. Number five Ego no Jugyo ga、mm, somewhere de arimas. So he has an English class at this place. Let's look for English. That's on Friday in that tealish green, I guess. Ego, Gakse Kaikan at the Student Union. Ego no Juyo ga Gakse Kaikan de Arimas. Arimas. And number six, the final question. Luka wa Bungaku no Juyo ga Doko de Arimas ka? This is ask, asking us a direct question. Where does Luke have his literature class? Bungaku is literature. And we're going to look for it on the schedule.、Uh, literature is in the red、uh, at the bottom in room 207. 207. Maru means O in this case, 207, basically. So we're going to say Luka wa Bungaku no jugyo ga. Room 207 de arimas. Yes. Here are the answers in bold.、Mm. Listening practice, we're wrapping up the lesson. Not too long today. I'm going to read two compositions twice. Listen and write down what you hear. Pause the video if you need more time. I'm going to reveal the answers right after I finish the second iteration. 
Number one, here we go. あさって日本語のクイズがありますあさって日本語のクイズがあります Pause the video if you need more time. Here is the answer. あさって日本語のクイズがあります Number two. ディズニーはオーランドでキャラクターグッズのイベントがあります。ディズニーはオーランドでキャラクターグッズのイベントがあります。And the answer for that one is ディズニーはオーランドでキャラクターグッズのイベントがあります。No kanji, all either ひらがな or カタカナ。Um, if you're wondering, this オーランド is Orlando. It's a city in Florida. This is where Disney World is located、uh, in America. Orlando de character goods, a character goods or merchandise event there is. And Disney is having it. So Disney is putting on this event in Orlando. Activity five translation practice.、Uh, translate the following statements into either English or Japanese. Pause the video, try it on your own. I'm going to reveal the answers right now. T- lady at the top says, えほんがありますか This is a question. えほんがありますか She's asking, do you have a picture book? Do you have a picture book? A book with pictures? <laughs> Basically. The guy in the bottom says, I had class yesterday in the student union. In Japanese, that would be what? That. 昨日学生会館で授業がありました Past tense, right? ありました And we're back to our key sentence. この店は絵本があります。この店は絵本があります。This means that this store has picture books or stocks picture books.、Uh, all of that to mean that they basically sell picture books. And our 宿題 our homework. 何がありますか What do you have right now in your pocket? Uh, on your person, in your room, in your bank account. <laughs> Let me know、uh, using the structure that we learned today.、Um, and if you're having some sort of event or if there's some kind of event in your life that's happening soon,、uh, let me know as well. Maybe using words like daishu or even senshu, daigets, sengets, whatever.、Uh, let me know about any of those things. And as usual, there is a worksheet for this lesson. You can find it、uh, at my website. Just go to the description. There will be a link. You can click that, go there, download it, fill it out, and the answer sheet is also there for free as well. That's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope it wasn't just an overload of information. It was a really short lesson today, and I hope you enjoyed it. See you in a future lecture.